Um, listen, I think a couple of people have said something about uh, recently, even about uh, my talking on these videos being transparent and authentic and things like that. Okay. I want you guys to know that uh, if you don't know it already, I really, 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 really believe the stuff I talk about. Uh, there's no question in my mind at all. There's no if, ands, or buts. I, I don't wonder whether or not what happened to me is true or not. There's no question in my mind. Mine is very, very, very clear. So when I tell you these things, I mean it. So when I say we are all one, I know that that is true. So for me to put a mask or play like or or whatever to you is a waste of time because ultimately whether you realize it or not we are tied together you know everything I've ever done you know every thought I've ever had and you always will because you choose to not realize it in this moment in this singular moment doesn't change the facts. The facts are that we are all tied together and you have access to every single moment of my life, my existence, my all that's ever been. So to cover it up and not be authentic and not be transparent is a waste of valuable time in my, my mind. I'm going to 5D where 5D we can read each other completely and totally. There is no judgment and that's the reason why you don't have judgment because you're going to read everything about everybody everything that they ever did and said in the third dimension. But there won't, you won't care. It will be nothing but joy and love because you'll understand the game. And that's why you have to get this, Not there's no such thing as good, there's no such thing as bad, and no judgment thing down. Because by the time you get to fifth dimension, everyone will know every, every, every thought you've ever had, every deed you've ever done. So if you, the first thing you've got to do is you've got to make peace with it yourself. Okay, and once you make peace with it yourself and understand where it came from and why and it was all agreed on and nobody got hurt, everything is as it should be. When you do that, then you can step into the land of, I don't care what anybody knows. Ask me. I don't care. Ask me. I'll answer any question you've got because I cannot possibly be in 5D and be afraid of you knowing anything about me. I can't. And that's my choice. So when I'm open and transparent with you guys, there's a reason for it. It's practice. It's practice because good, bad, right, wrong, ugly or pretty. Um, I don't, I don't care because we are one. I don't care if you know everything about me. Um, I don't even care if you judge me for it. I really don't. Uh, that's why that event not too long ago where she was trashing me for being a horrible nurse or getting my license pulled or whatever upset me so much is because I did care. And so right then I knew that I had some cleaning up to do because it, I shouldn't, it shouldn't matter. It shouldn't matter at all. Uh, what, what you guys know and what I did, um, in the big picture going out and looking in, all of it is understandable. Everything, everybody understands in everything that anybody says and does in context is absolutely perfect when you take it in context when you're in amnesia and you judge you undoubtedly every time will take it out of context uh, like I've said before don't judge walk a mile in somebody else's shoes before you judge them that kind of thing well that's the reason why I am open transparent authentic and maybe that's why it works that when I struggle I tell you when I get out of the struggle I tell you because I want you to know uh, me, the way I am now, here, in this process, on the way to knowing everything about me. Okay? Well, this has come up out of the blue, so, yeah. Well, I don't know how to stop this thing. Anyway, so that's the reason why I will continue to do that, and if somebody judges me on the comments or whatever and it upsets me, then I will use that as information that I need to use to do a better job at accepting and loving and understanding myself and my actions, which hopefully will lead to me being open, non-judgmental, and accepting of everyone else's. And it's a process. It's a process. Uh, I've been on, in 3D for a long time. A lot of beliefs, a lot of situations, a lot of issues have happened. And... Uh, And uh, so <clears throat> there's a lot that I walk through. I've never told you guys 
uh, that this is going to be an easy march. It's certainly not for me, although every day I counter that and go, yes, it is. It's easy. It's easy. All I've got to do is just do this, just tweak and tweak and tweak. But anyway, I just want to do a video real quick and explain why I am authentic, why the hair's not made up, why I don't put, nothing's wrong with doing my makeup. You've seen me with my hair done and my makeup on. I love doing that. But when I'm busy, I don't have time for it. But I, I don't do that for you. I don't do that for this picture. I do that for me because I want to do it. And that's where my life has changed a lot is I'm learning to do things because I want to do them. I buy clothes and wear clothes the way I want them to wear them, not because of what uh, other people think is cool. And for me, being raised where a woman is be taking care of their family and supportive, and it, it, I was almost raised that it was a good thing for you not to care about yourself at all. Um, if you did at all, then it was a bad thing. You weren't a, a good woman. So I'm having to unlearn all of that day by day, moment to moment, bit by bit, so that it becomes everything that I do is because I want to do it, not because I've been told to do it, not because I have to do it, not because I'm supposed to do it, but because I want to do it every moment of every day. Because that's what 5D is. That's what freedom is, is doing exactly what you want all the time, no matter what. And... I think I'm a pretty decent person. So I think doing what I want to do when I want to do it is going to be good for the whole place anyway. All right. So uh, that's just a couple of thoughts. I don't even know what I'll call this. Maybe this will be a random thought video too. I'll have to watch it and see. Okay, guys. Uh, yeah. Love you guys so much. Huge hugs. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.